Welcome to the Neurology Channel, a YouTube channel dedicated to all things neurology. We have a passion for sharing our knowledge and experience with others. On this channel, we cover a wide range of topics related to the brain and nervous system, including common neurological conditions, diagnostic tests, and treatment options. We also discuss the latest research and developments in the field of neurology. Whether you're a medical professional looking to stay up to date with the latest research, or a patient interested in learning more about the brain and how it works, the Neurology Channel has something for you. So, if you're interested in all things neurology, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. Thanks for stopping by and we can't wait to share more about the fascinating world of neurology with you. Hello and welcome to our video on Idiopathic Intracranial Hypertension or IIH. This is a rare and potentially serious condition that affects the brain and the nervous system. In this video, we will be discussing the symptoms, treatments, and coping strategies for IIH. So, let's get started. Symptoms and Impacts IIH is also known as pseudotumor cerebri. It is characterized by increased pressure inside the skull. The exact cause of IIH is unknown, but it is believed to be linked to hormonal imbalances, certain medications, and obesity. Symptoms of IIH include headaches, vision problems, ringing in the ears, and nausea. The pressure inside the skull can also cause damage to the optic nerve, leading to blindness. The impacts of IIH can be debilitating, and it can significantly impact the quality of life of those affected. The condition can also lead to depression and anxiety. Treatments Treatment for IIH typically involves a combination of medications and lifestyle changes. Medications are used to reduce the pressure inside the skull, while lifestyle changes such as weight loss, reducing salt intake, and regular exercise can help to control symptoms. In severe cases, surgery may be required to alleviate pressure on the brain and optic nerve. Coping Living with IIH can be challenging, but there are ways to cope with the condition. It's important to manage stress levels, get enough sleep, and maintain a healthy diet and exercise routine. Talking to a therapist or joining a support group can also help to manage the emotional impact of the condition. Research and Progress There is ongoing research into IIH, including studies into the underlying causes of the condition and new treatments. Researchers are also investigating the potential use of new technologies such as virtual reality to help manage symptoms. In conclusion, IIH is a serious condition that can significantly impact the lives of those affected. However, with proper treatment and support, it is possible to manage the symptoms and live a fulfilling life. If you suspect you may have IIH, it's important to see a doctor as soon as possible. Thank you for watching. Thank you for watching the Neurology Channel. We hope you found this video informative and useful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel if you want to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. We post new content every week so make sure to check back often for more insights and information on all things neurology. If you're interested in learning more about a specific topic, let us know in the comments and we'll do our best to cover it in a future video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.